Hey everyone, this is Benjamin here from the African Geek and you are welcome to this fantastic tutorial on Canva. In this tutorial, we are going to... Uh... <laughs> oh my god, this. did you realize how I flopped, you know, with my intro? And let me just start again. Hey everyone, this is Benjamin here from the African Geek and you are welcome to this fantastic tutorial on Canva. Before we get started, make sure to smash the subscribe button and hit the bell icon to get notified anytime I upload new videos. So, let's jump straight into Canva. So, you know the thing, I I learned my lessons now because for some time now, anytime I get to start with tutorials, my internet just messes up. So, I just decided to get myself ready, have everything intact before I start with this tutorial. So, I'm just hoping nothing gets to distract us so that we can have some smooth tutorial. Okay, so let's just jump straight into it. And the first thing we'll do is, as usual, create a custom dimension. And this time around, I'm going with 1920 by 1080 to have you know this hd kind of like dimension and after you do it just in case you don't know where to press or you don't know where to click just click on create design and it would open a new tab for you okay and you can see i'm really really ready so what you can just do is you can just come to frames <sighs> should i try okay so you come to frames okay into elements and you see frames if you can't see just keep scrolling you'll find it then you come to see all then we have all of these things over here and i just had to scroll down the more and i came to find all of these so this is what i'm just going to do i'm just going to um use the b to the e to the a to the t where is the t okay and please try not to be a copycat okay and the reason why i'm saying it is you can use any word at all you want to use i'm going with bit so just in case your word is longer you can just reduce the size and arrange it that's all okay so and i hope it's fair you know like i'm always a nice person so yeah and i would come over here and i would search for some rocking uh, i'm just going high <laughs> i just thought mm. did you hear what i just said yeah you didn't hear it so let's just continue okay so i'll look for something cool no when i was trying it earlier i used this photo but i used this photo let me show you i used this one but this one also looks catchy in a way so i'll use this as a reference okay oh there's an ambulance there's someone dead oh corona okay so i'll send to back okay so that would we'll use this as a reference as a reference photo if i should say okay good then what i'll do is i'll come and drop it into the b and i'll double click okay now try to scale it up like what i have And you don't need to be perfect because no one is actually going to enter into your, um, how do you call it, into, <laughs> uh, no one is going to enter into the alphabet and see what you have. Okay, so, and you just need to have, okay, so let me just zoom in a little bit. And uh, you see, okay, so this is what we have with the B and it's looking cool let me just i think i need to scale it up more and uh, i'll scale it up okay so that i need to come up more okay so this is what we are just going to do to be scaling things up okay so yeah uh, i think this is fine somewhere here is, is sorry i'm not talking i'm just also trying to gauge well with my eyes okay so something like this then 
the same procedure uh, for the E okay so I double click and you know for the start you didn't see you didn't really see it well but just try and follow you know even if you're not getting it just try doing something and you definitely get it so the main thing is when you're trying to align the photo with you know with what's in the back the main photo you're adjusting becomes um, lighter a little bit so i'm just trying to use some of the uh, main things in the back to align my photo okay that's that's all i'm trying to do and i know as at now you wouldn't be able to see um what's going on but don't worry you see it so and when you love it you'd want to do it so then i'm coming into the a and i think even with this tutorial i'm not wasting time oh hey I'm, i've really done well clap for me please clap for me you heard me i know you're watching and even though you're following you should still clap for me what do you think okay so i think um okay so i'm using the television this one to align okay and i'll just increase it a little bit okay and you know canva the reason why you have to do all of this is canva doesn't have or hasn't come up with any feature that can actually can actually help you do those things quickly so you just have to go you know the hard way and it doesn't hurt you know if you really want your design to stand out it doesn't hurt going the hard way okay so still increasing i'm using, still using the television as my main reference okay okay so i think it's fine and let me just take off the back so this is what we have and it's looking cool and fresh so what i'll do is maybe i'll just move this up okay so that it looks like a continuation and aside that everything is looking fresh so i'll just reduce the opacity um size of this a little bit and it's looking nice bit by dre if you know them just tell them that i'm like sponsoring them for free like over here okay so the next thing i'll do is i'll come i'll come into my uploaded um things or photos okay and uh so you know this was i forgot to actually make this load and since i don't want it to waste our time what i can do is i'll just scroll down okay so if you want to know why i have all of these photos over here check my instagram and you'd understand why i didn't talk much about it because i'm not here to promote my instagram i'm just here to uh give you what you're looking for I know you, you you just tuned in here to watch this tutorial, so I'll just give you what you want. And uh, I'll take done. And what I'll do is I'll reduce the opacity. And if you haven't seen my um, video on the texture, just check it out. You'd love it. Okay, so I'll add the second texture. It give us some dirt particles. Oh uh, no, I'm not trying to overshadow the A. Okay, so I'll just something like this. And it's also looking fresh. And we have this beat which is looking cool, interesting, fantastic, everything. Yeah. And what else can I do? I think we are done. The most part of it we are done. So I just want to go crazy a little bit. So let me see if I can copy something so let me open this and uh, it's opening and you know ju just in case you want us to design or something like together you can always hit me up on my instagram and i'll be glad to respond to you speak to you and then um, we can come up with something okay so i'll just come here and um, paste and like i always say 
programmers and designers are always good at copy and paste so i don't want to now go search for monserrat i'm using the monserrat font okay so i'll just come here beat and i'll say beat yeah. <laughs> i don't even know what to say so beat beat s beat beat <laughs> beat my brain no beat the underlining underlining um the underlining combo you know just to make it sound like i'm very serious and i'm into music i know you know what's up that look i know nothing i'm just here trying to play with designs and creating tutorials aside that what else nothing okay so the underlining combo beats look if you love this give me a like okay and i just want this video to hit like five thousand likes can we do that let's do it together this this is about me and you okay so let's do it let's give this video a push share it if you know anyone interested in, in canva okay and wants to take their canva design to the next level just share this video to them let them come check out all the videos i have for them and uh, i'm sure they would enjoy it so much so if i let's say i want to just go and make this wild i can just you know come here and with the spacing uh, letter space now just increase it okay increase it like this to beat the aligning combo look just tell me i want to know in the comment section if you don't like this just tell me if you like it just tell me let's see how it goes I'm already loving it i love it so that's what i wanted to show you and the name is benjamin but before i go let me do something you know just something so i just I want to adjust the e okay okay it's looking better so yeah this is what i wanted to do and i'll see you don't forget with what i said like tell me if you like it if you don't like it also let me know if you also want to take this to the next level we can do something interesting and i don't know why i don't want to end with this tutorial so i have this texture and this crack sort of thing okay and i can scale it up and send to back okay so that it gets to look like uh, a portion of our okay so let me just put it here and you no, know, just to give some some sort of uh, thing to it. I don't know what thing, but something. Okay, so just tell me how it looks. If it doesn't look nice, maybe I can just put it here. Okay, and I'll just it. Okay, so I think something like this is fine. So yeah. Just let me know what you think about this and the name is Benjamin. Don't forget to smash the subscribe button and hit the bell icon to get notified anytime I upload new videos. So I'll see you in my next video.